We're running more lighting switch legs and we're finishing up the low voltage runs. It is a Wednesday. We are in Middletown, Rhode Island. This is part eight of the video series. So what I got going on for today is I'm showing you guys here that we actually started installing these plastic grommets inside the wall here. And the reason for that is I got a ton of low voltage runs which are going to be ran on the inside of that wall there for some LED strip tape. Basically, we're going to be mounting the LED strip tape underneath the counter there to provide some accent lighting underneath that counter. So that's going to work out really nice the way we have it right now. Towards the left side there, you saw that piece of cardboard and we like to use the cardboard basically to just poke a hole in it and then poke the wire out into the strategic location that it needs to be in. Over here, we got five sets of low voltage wires. Each workstation requires one low voltage wire and that's going to be for more LED strip tape. Over here is basically going to be the waiting area and they wanted more LED strip tape over there so we got to start running wires for that as well. On each side of the front entryway door here they wanted sconces so I got the wires ran for that as well. Basically we just brought a 12-3 up to the top of the ceiling there and then I brought a 12-2 out for the sconces so I basically just labeled what switch leg did what and that's that box with the you know four square cover on it with a bunch of writing on it. I wrote you know red was pendants and then black with sconces. Over here in this room um, basically I started running all the switch legs for that. That was where the 11 switch legs are gonna go and I had a bunch more questions on that so in this room here as you can see all, look at all the you know the writing on this duct tape here. This room is gonna be controlling all of the lights in the front area so all the works stations, um, the hair cutting stations, the washing stations, it's going to be controlling all the lighting for that. Those sconces um, that I just showed you in the previous clip, all the lighting is controlled from this room. And then we also started finishing up these panels here. So both panels are finally all cut in. I had a bunch of questions like, hey, why don't you guys put all the breakers in? And the reason why we don't do this, and if you're an electrician, you probably know, is if we put those breakers in there, someone's going to open up the cover and they're going to turn everything on. And that creates a really big safety issue. We started cutting in all these quads, all the plugs and all the switches. So we got a ton more stuff done. I also started putting the boxes up inside the bathrooms there. There's two boxes. I had a bunch of questions more on fire alarm wire the wire has to be rated and it has to say you know you know certified and approved for Rhode Island use so if you're in the Massachusetts or Rhode Island area give us a call we're taking new clients I personally answer every single phone call